Hi, welcome to an episode of Noise Pollution. My name is Bobby Vibes, and I am thoroughly enjoying being alive at the moment. Well, partly. I'm in. Uh, it's uh, almost two o'clock. Very strange, slightly strange day. It's the twenty Monday, the twenty seventh of March. Uh, I like Mondays; they're okay. Well, especially today. I'm um, I'm in detox day one. Oh. So, uh, if anyone who knows me, who's had a chat with me, I used to, um, I used to be banging into detox retox. So, from the the October the thirty first to uh, Jan- basically January uh, twenty twenty. January the 23rd, 2023, I was in a really good little, little zone. Um, I was, um, detoxing the first 23 days of the month. And then the last remaining days of the month, I would be partying. I would be taking all the, um, the, uh, the, uh, option, the available options. Um, I may, mainly because I feel like I was in such a good routine because I was new to the, I had a new, you know, sort of relatively new job working for the Bings. I was trying to impress everyone. And then, um, yeah, I think, you know, my, you know, my, uh, my, my, my regimen sort of gently, gently slid away. So as I say, I'm, uh, I'm indeed detox day one. Um, no, uh, I'm away on tour soon. So yeah, I'm going to feel, I'm going to feel nice and fresh. So how how have I managed to um, how have I kicked the day off? Well, again, it's a bit. It's just it all comes at once. Honey's gone away. Uh, you going? You going away again? Yeah, going away. Oh. When you back? Thursday night. Okay, great. Love you. Love you. So I'm just cycling to um, Hope Street Hotel now. Honey's gone to uh, for a team gathering for her work. She works for the Rose. Castle Castle Foundation in Cumbria, and she's down in uh, Cambridge. Love you, honey. Pretty vibey morning. I just um, I uh, last night was I sort of took a um, quite a quite a large um, amount of um, psychedelic uh, mushrooms to try and um, to try and help me kind of get my and then had a really good night's sleep. So I uh, got up this morning, I made and delivered three milks and then took Connie for a walk, uh, made sure everything was okay and then uh, basically cycled over to... Lovely, lovely day. All right, Bill Withers. I think I'm the only one in here. So um, yeah, I, uh, I needed to, as it's, as, it's, uh, as it's the detox day one, I needed to get into Hope Street Hotel Spa um, quite early on. So I was in there about quarter past nine. Anyone who is, again, who's had a, a chat with me or seen a few of these, there was a moment when I was trying to become a member of Hope Street Hotel Spa and it's about 200 quid a month. But basically I realized I only really need it once a month. And um, the deal you can get is like 80 quid and you can get three hours in the spa and um, a meal. And uh, yeah, you'll see what I got. And uh, because it's so early, there's no one in there. Chuff all in there. Yeah. Oh, Lovely spa. The music's a bit mad. Come and thankfully, uh, yeah, it was the only one. It's great. I felt like a absolute billionaire just me in this huge spa. Ooh. Snazzy door lockers. Again, I was just sure I don't want to be the guy who's filming in the spa. Honestly, I don't. I just I got a sense that there was no one else in there. Um, don't worry, you know. Um, if I if you if I go to the spa, I keep my phone squirreled away. It was just because I was aware that there was no one else in there. And plus, it's day one of detox. Um, I'm reading this book about um, the four disciplines of execution. I say I'm reading it. I just carry it around. I've, I didn't read any of it today. Uh, weird flex. Happy place. Yeah. 
Lovely. There is no one in, so I'm going to do 100 lengths of the um, swimming pool and just get in all the saunas till half 12. I'm going to have some food and then I'm going to head back to Noise Pollution Studios. Hi, that's where I am now. Um, I did do a hundred. Le- I did a hundred lengths of the swimming pool, so that's fifteen hundred meters. Uh, very relaxing. I feel like um, that's what it is. If I'm not, um, if I'm not, uh, you know, um, taking drugs, then I just should be swimming or I should be, you know, exercising basically. All right, see you in a bit. Detox day one. It's going to be the last video. I've just done fifty lengths in the pool. As people starting to arrive now, I've been. Um, been it by myself for ages, but I'm just in in the sauna. That's the uh, the herbal sauna, and you can add your own um, add your own oily water to it to get it nice and roasty. I was the only one in there. People, there were, uh, five people total in there, and they all go in the 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 the, uh, the pool outside, the heated pool, and no one's in the sauna. No one's in the normal pool. It's like pearls before swine. I'm reading. Four disciplines of execution, and I'm drinking coffee. I'll do a recap in a bit. Happy detox. <sighs> Happy detox, everybody. If anyone wants to join me um, on the detox, give me a shout. You can come in. Uh, here's what I here's what I have to do with my phone. I've got this uh, app called Block App. And uh, even that tries to get you addicted to it. It tries to give you little stars and points and stuff. Um, but here's me um, blocking all my apps and show. Sure. So I'm just going to delete all. There are a few people here at this point, so I didn't want to be the f- cringy phone gimp. Um, but I'm just lean into the cringy. The C, C, F, C, P, G. So this is the message. You try and go into um, you try and go into Googs, and it tells you to uh, do something better. With a picture of my little dog in Sefton Park. Yeah, so I'm uh, yeah I'm away on tour soon. Um, oh, I'm a day consecutive meds. I didn't manage to do it yesterday, but there's my meditation app, Insight Timer, and uh, here's where I am uh, over the next few days. Here is my schedule. Uh, when I go on tour, so we've got this thing called um, Master Tour, which is quite exciting. Um, oh, it doesn't want to change. Uh, yeah, you can see on the 30th, well, you can't really see the 1st of April, I'm down in Bristol with having a, some pre, two pre production days. Then the 3rd of April, I'm down in Southampton, 4th in London at the Lafayette, day off in Nottingham. 6th and 7th, uh, you can't see it, but we're in Nottingham on the 6th, Glasgow on the 7th, and then um, day off, oh, where are we? Glasgow 7th, Stereo, Deaf Institute in Manchester on the 8th, day off, heading that back down to Bristol, Rough Trade Bristol, and then the Workman's Club in Dublin, then I'm going to fly back, and I'll be back with everyone, I'll be back in the Bings on the 14th. So yeah, I'm going to sign off. One one thing, yeah, one last little... T- um, one last little thing is uh, I was looking, I've got some old footage of the Casimir and I just wanted to, um, yeah, just a, I've recorded a couple of videos. There's one I did, it was the band Future Islands when they played, so. To be with us this evening and their new album entitled Singles, there it is right there. I think they played uh, Letterman about a year or six months before they played the Casimir and there was a big buzz. Um, I realised that uh, Samuel Herring, this lead singer, is only two years older than me is in stores later this month. Ladies and gentlemen, we couldn't be happier to have him here. Welcome Future Islands. Bad boy, bad boy. Very, um, very um, charismatic band. Uh, We had a bit of a kick about Everton supporter. Uh, I think they're all... So let's go to the crescendo of it where it gets everyone going.
Lovely, lovely moves. I think. Um, Thank you very much. Nice going. Letterman loves him. Paul, Sch Paul Schaefer loves him. That was wonderful. Thank you very much. What do you think, Paul? Fantastic. Fantastic. Paul likes him. Anyway, so here's some footage of when they played the Casimir. Then I'm going to get off. I'll probably just play two minutes of it. Live at the Casimir, um, the 5th of the 6th, 2014. It's almost 10 years ago. Lovely cars, the lovely cars. So uh, what did I do? I ended up going on a little mission up to the backstage area and setting my phone up there. Very charismatic band. I think I'll just show you a little bit of the actual show. Try and find the the big the big chant the big tune. Beautiful. Beautiful show in the cars. Look how look how rammed it is in there. This is uh, just filmed on GoPro. But when I was uh, do, I did a few little GoPro uh, shots in there. And I'm just saying, this is the they had their own front of the house, so I could just vibe out. I just see them coming up the stairs here. <laughs> Nice and guys. Nice one. Love, uh, love the, love the cars. Um, that's made me feel a bit better. Detox day one. Uh, I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. Um, I love you all. Bye bye.